Yo, 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 what's up? It's your boy, M. Breezy. And hey, man, we got breaking news, man. Dallas Cowboy, man. Some sad news, man. Our, our right tackle, man, Terrence Steele, man, is out for the rest of the season, man, the ACL town. Shocking, man. This, hey, this is, this is bad news, man. Man, this came at the wrong time, man. The guy was playing good, man. Y'all had found himself a home over there at right tackle, man, beside Zach Martin. One of the best in the game, man. Now he's out for the year, man. Devastating news for the Cowboys. And that's, you know, that's not too good news for uh, Dyke Prescott either. Because, man, you know, he's a big part of helping, helping protect the quarterback, man, on those um, outside pad rushes, man. Guys are gonna be missed, man. And, um, hey, man, it just, it just, it, it, it just some sad news, man. I sure hate this, man, for this guy. But uh, we uh, oh, we got Josh Ball, man. I don't know about Josh Ball playing over there, man. I don't know what's going on. Maybe they, maybe they moved Jason Peters to the right tackle, man. I think Tyron Smith are coming back, and more than likely now they're gonna rush him back. We're, we're not rushing, but speeding back in, you know, because he's going to be needed, man. Or they can move Tyler Smith to the right end and keep Peters at left, but we'll move uh, uh, Tyler Smith at right tackle and keep Jason Peters at left tackle until Tyron Smith come back. That would be the that would be the better move right there because Josh Ball, I, I don't, I don't. Hey man, I, I won't put all my stocking to, to this guy. Not at all whatsoever. But we did get some great news though. We signed T. Y. Hilton. Hey man, that was a, a, a good signing, man. T. Y. Man, you know, played several years, man, with the Colts, man. You know. Hey man, I, I, I like this move. I like this move. I like this move. But I, I don't know what kind of shape he is, in medically wise, because you know he's been out. So I don't know his what's going on with his uh, medical history, but they say he's in great shape. You know, he spent a decade with the Colts, man. They took him with the number over ninety two overall pick in the two thousand twelve NFL draft out of Florida International University. The veteran receiver has played hasn't played yet this season after his last year deal with the Colts that expired. In the end of 2021, the 33-year-old had 331 receiving yards and three touchdowns in 10 games last season in Indianapolis. In Indiana, in Indianapolis, he has a uh, he has 9,691 yards and 53 touchdowns in his career. That's 9,691 yards and 53 touchdowns in his career. The Cowboys' move to sign Hilton comes just after a very public public push to sign former New York Giant Odell Beckham Jr., who visited the Cowboys earlier this month, last week recently. Uh, we was unable to sign him because he, he he was still recovering from his injury. He didn't want and he didn't want to do no workout, so you know that was a zero for all three teams. That was interested in him. So now, Dyke Prescott got another target. Can Dyke Prescott get in the ball? Can Dyke Prescott get in the ball? That's going to be the question. No more excuses, man. No more excuses, man. Because the guy's a great, great rock runner. He plays slot, plays the outside. Hey man, the guy got speed too. The guy got speed. So uh We're gonna see, man. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. Cause Washington, Washington, Jane Washington came off an injury yesterday. I think he uh his first pass, he dropped it. So they heard him put him on the bench. And they were like, no, no, this ain't gonna work out. So we gotta make a move. Gotta make a move. Hopefully, man, it'll work out, man. But we shall see. We shall see. Because we done had a lot of great guys in to play wide receiver. But it just, it just didn't work out because our crew B, one, could not get on the ball. 
So I don't want no more excuses than that. I don't want to hear about T.Y. Hills and what hurt and all that he ain't played in all a year. And all. Man, look, I'm tired of these excuses. I'm tired of these excuses. You got another bona fide weapon. You got CD, Gallup, now you got T.Y. Hilton. Sooner or later, man, the excuses are going to run out. Sooner or later, the excuses are going to run out. That's all I got to say. But hopefully, man, it'll work out, man. Jason Peters over there, that left tackle man, a uh, 40-year-old veteran, man. You know, he's 40 years old, so we need Urban to get Tyron back, man. So we can push, either push Peters, Peters over there at left guard or bring Tyler Smith back right guard. And, you, well, you know, somebody got the man down the right tackle, so I'm thinking they're going to be Tyler Smith. And keep Peters over there at left guard when Tyron Smith comes back. So that's, that would be the better move. Then the line, the old line will be solidified. Solidified, solidified. So, uh, yeah, man, I just had to uh, shout out y'all the breaking news, man. The Dallas Cowboys signed T.Y. Hilton. Terrence Steele out for the season, man. But uh, hopefully, man, we're going to push through it, man. We're we going to push through it. We got a good, uh, a core group of guys, man, you know, that uh, I think can get the job done. But I just, I just only, I just got one only concern. Y'all know what it is: quarterback position. Everything else should be fine. But hey, man, that's all I have for y'all, man. Uh, hit the subscribe button, man. Hit that like button. Leave your boy coming down below. And tell her what, and tell me what you think about, man. The Terrence, Steele, Terrence Steele, who's gonna, who they gonna put on that side of, uh, uh, of the line, and uh, uh, T.Y. Hilton signing, man. It's your boy, M. Breezy. I'm out.